Statistics revealed that Nigeria has only 2 million qualified and registered teachers that oversee affairs in both private and public schools. This could not be far from reasons why the largest black nation in the world still stands tall as one of the countries with half level of poorly educated or half-baked students. To address this anomaly and restore the country's lost glory, the Teachers Registration Council of Nigeria made it a point of responsibility for every teacher to be accredited in order to kick out quacks from the noble profession. The Registrar of the Council, Josiah Ajiboye, while appealing to those yet to be registered, urged them to do so before December 2019 or risk losing their jobs. Uh, the mandate of TRCN covers both public and private schools and we are not going to go back on that. So if you are teaching even in private schools, believe you me, you are supposed to be registered, be qualified, registered and licensed by TRCN. If by that date you are not, I think your job is being treated. If we do this, it will improve the quality of our teachers. We will now know who and who is teaching our children. It's not just going to be, it's no longer going to be an all commerce thing. What we are trying to do is to first the, the benchmark. We have a benchmark, the modules that we are developed for the various categories of teachers. We have to do the brailing of those modules first before we go to brailing of the test items, the questions. Our teachers, some of our prospective teachers who are Arabic medium only, uh, we also have a problem with them because these people have been trained using Arabic language purely. And we are also working on that to make sure we get an Arabic institute to make sure they change all the, um, the modules into Arabic and also the question items as well into Arabic. This is the fourth examination in the series since its inception in 2017 with about 80% compliance so far. In 2018, 16,995 teachers sat for the professional qualification examination. 11,550 of them passed, while 5,405 of them failed. About 30,000 teachers will be sitting for this year's computer-based professional qualifying examination nationwide from 7th to 8th of June this year. Paulum David. See any news.